Namaste. This is just an informal talk to let you know that this is a once in a lifetime opportunity, actually once in several lifetimes opportunity to meditate and try to reach enlightenment. What is it? Well, all the major planets except Mars are now retrograde. And retrograde Jupiter is about to conjunct the galactic center. This is huge, okay? It only happens once in every, I don't know, 500 to 1,000 years. It's an extremely rare time. And it's one that everyone should try to take advantage of. That means whatever your spiritual practice is, you should do as much of it as possible over the next few weeks. Ideally, until the middle of September when Jupiter goes direct. So I can feel it already. I felt it the last time when Jupiter conjuncted the galactic center. I think it was about two months ago. It was in direct motion at that time. But now, along with everybody else, <laughs> it's gone retrograde. So this is the time, you see, when all of the normal activities in life are broken. Because the planets that regulate them are moving backwards. But people are so dull, they don't understand this. So they keep trying to do what they've been doing and it's not working. It's not working at all. This is why I said in the previous videos about verbal delusion, the world is mad. The world is insane. Huh? Society is built on a house of cards. It's built on only a construction of words. But words aren't reality. Words are just symbols. So we make these elaborate constructions of words and think that they represent reality, but they never are fully reliable or accurate because they're incomplete. So when exceptional circumstances occur, huh? black swans, <laughs> Well, actually, this isn't a black swan, you know. These retrograde planets were predicted and known for a long, long time. Joni Petri has been talking about it for a couple of years. That this is going to be an extraordinary time, once in a thousand years. Huh? Also, the Indian astrologers. So, well, you know... If you just would follow what the cosmos is doing, you would understand, oh, this is an amazing time. Something wonderful is possible. Something that does not happen very often. You see, we are not the doers. This is the basic misunderstanding of people in conditioned consciousness. First of all, they think that they exist, <laughs> or they think the ego is real. Huh? The ego is not real. The ego is another one of these semantic constructions. <laughs> we have many, many times linked to the Mula Pariyaya Sutra, where the Buddha describes the root sequence of thoughts that creates the ego. 
How many of you have watched it? How many of you have observed it in yourself? This is a good opportunity for this kind of work. But really, when Jupiter conjuncts the galactic center, when it happened, what was it, 24 years ago, in 1984, that was when I got my first enlightenment experience. Similar to now, I had just uh, felt the need to go within it took precedence over everything. I'm not the doer. I'm not even the knower. But the cosmos is flowing in a certain direction. So the best thing is to just go along with it. Don't get caught up trying to force things to work in the old way or the way it worked when the planets were direct, because it won't happen. It's, it's not going to happen. <laughs> People are so dull. But be attuned to the cosmic flow and follow the energy. It'll take you to enlightenment. <laughs> it worked for me in 1984, but because I didn't understand what was happening, I didn't have the background I couldn't retain the state. It was only later when I did the research and found out what really happened and understood how it worked, then I was able to revitalize that state and restore the results completely. So <laughs> this is the time to go for it. This is the time to like turn off the internet, take your, take your phone, turn it off, Lock yourself in your room. <laughs> Call out for, for meals. <laughs> and just meditate or whatever your spiritual practice is. Because at this time you can make more progress in just the next few weeks. I'd say the next month or so. You can make more progress than in the last 10 years. If you clear the space for it. Huh? If you drop all the stuff that isn't working right now, it'll still be there when the planets go direct in September and October. But right now, it's an unparalleled, very, very rare, very valuable opportunity that you can take advantage of to make tremendous progress in your spiritual life. So... I'm taking some time off from making videos. I'm dropping everything. Huh? Well, I pretty much dropped everything already. <laughs> Since I took sannyas, gradually I've been letting go, letting go more and more. Now, these last few days, I'm feeling that galactic core energy again. Huh? And I know it's time to go within and just let go of everything and see where it takes me. I'm even willing to give up this body if necessary. I really don't care about it. What's all important, what's most important and should be for everyone is to attain self-realization. We've got over 800 videos on this site now and almost 1,800 subscribers. Huh? The other day we got, I don't know, 600 views or something for the first time. So people are watching these videos, but are you putting them into practice? Are you making room in your life for spiritual practices and actually doing the work? Actually taking my advice, Going back to the beginning series, Matrix Learning, Foundation Series, huh? and building a foundation for your spiritual practice. Don't just wing it. Follow the scriptures. Don't be part of a group. 
Just take the instructions direct from the scriptures and apply them in your life. That's the safest, surest path. And it will also protect you from being cheated. So this is your chance. Huh? People always write me and saying, I've been meditating for years and nothing's happening. Well, <laughs> this is your chance. Now, clear the decks. Cancel all your appointments. Stay in the house, which is a good idea anyway during coronavirus. The whole world is mad. The world is a, an open air insane asylum. So stay out of it. Just keep to yourself and the scriptures and follow them and go within and see where this energy leads. You won't be disappointed. <laughs> Aum Tat Sat. I'll see you in a while. Aung Shakti Aung.